A five-year-old girl stabbed to death. At this hour, charges are pending. CBS 2's Jeremy Ross found out police believe the victim and her attacker were related. CPD received multiple calls of a person stabbed. This is crazy. There was a couple of neighbors. One of my neighbors were helping her. Then the paramedics came to the fire department. They came pretty fast. The victim who was stabbed multiple times was already in the ambulance. Crazy. That's it. just sad. I mean, just I don't know where I seen her yesterday and today in the morning she's gone. Just, just sad. Just sad. Saturday morning, Jose Malgar saw his five-year-old neighbor in critical need of help outside. In an area with stuffed animals, bikes, and toys, there were also investigators, squads, and police tape. It happened on Fulton near Kadzi around 9.15. The medical examiner's office says five-year-old Serenity Arrington suffered stab wounds and arrived at the hospital but would be pronounced dead minutes later. CPD does have somebody in custody. At this time, we believe that they are related. Other neighbors describe the 27-year-old woman now in police custody as recently suffering a family loss and dealing with depression and or previous mental health issues. Looking into if the suspect has a history of mental illness. Uh, the detectives are working on that, so they're, they're touching base with that and with DCFS and everything else. So it's a sad, just a sad story. So far, I've been here two years. It's, I love it. It's quiet and everything, but never got it right next to me. Police say they've received multiple calls for service at the home before, but didn't go into specifics. Charges are pending against the 27-year-old woman. Outside police headquarters, Jeremy Ross, CBS 2 News.